This is the video update for Tuesday, August 31st, 2021 for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. We're coming into what would have been our, uh, our first week back uh, together after our summer schedule. It is the either the last week of our summer schedule or the first week of our fall schedule, depending on uh, if you start counting by the first Sunday that I preach or the the last week where I'm not writing a sermon. Um, as originally planned, uh, this week would have looked a little bit differently. Um, different. Reverend Kimberly Debus, our affiliate community minister, was supposed to fly out today uh, and join us for an outdoor tent revival on Thursday night and then our water communion in gathering on Sunday. Because we're in the orange on the COVID-19 risk dial, that, that will be different. Um, on Thursday night, we'll be online on Zoom using the Vespers link that we used for much of last year. Um, uh, Kimberly will be leading that service, and I'll be participating in it, which is exciting. Um, and then on Sunday, um, we'll be live streaming on our YouTube channel. Um, it'll be our first test of our new live streaming equipment. Um, so some of us will be gathered in the sanctuary broadcasting from there live at 10 a.m. on Sunday. You know, this is not exactly how we imagined starting the year, and that's uh, fair to acknowledge. But it is the hand that we're dealt. We're, we remain um at high risk for COVID-19 infections um, the city just updated the risk dial uh for this week and we we remain at mid orange which means that we are um, primarily online at the church and this I think is just how it's going to be for a little while you know we're we're getting ready um to run this church here and and be flexible so you'll see me some days um doing updates from here, some days um, from the church, some Sundays I imagine will be live streamed, um, some Sundays will be in person, and if we get real bad, then we'll have some Sundays that are, are pre-recorded services. We do this because to take care of each other is, is elemental to Unitarian Universalism, and that's what we'll talk about more on Sunday. That our message of interconnection and responsibility to each other is really highlighted by this moment. The other change um, going forward is uh, is that we're gonna, well, we're going to send out um, email-based e-blasts twice a week. We're gonna continue to do that as we did over the summer. These video updates are going to move back to five per week. Um, that's for a couple reasons. Um, one is is simply that it is, for me, easier to maintain a practice of putting out one a day. Um, and also, uh, that allows us some flexibility around topics. We, we I found this summer um, that doing these updates twice a week meant that most of the updates that I was sending out were about COVID-19. And that's just simply not reflective of my life, the life of our community, um, or the ministry that we create together. Uh, we are about a lot more than the pandemic. So we'll move these back to, to five times a week. Um, you can subscribe to this YouTube channel to get notifications when a new one goes up, um, or, uh, or check us out on Facebook or on other social media platforms. We'll be providing links to these. Anyway, I will see you on Thursday night um, for the first service of our new congregational year um, that Reverend Devis is leading. And then I will hopefully see you again online on Sunday as we formally open the new congregational year, um, albeit in a live streamed fashion. Have a great week, everybody.